Stuck weather now. Americans across the country experiencing bouts of severe weather. Look at this record rainfall in five Southern California cities. Multiple inches of snow coming down in Utah. A tornado ripping through rural portions of Missouri. Another twister touching down in Kansas. And now the East Coast, including New York, being slammed with a powerful nor'easter. News Nation correspondent Tom Negevin live in New York City. So, Tom, the storm is not done yet. Not done yet, Nicole. In fact, there's a flash flood watch in effect for New York City right now. We're hoping it is uh, wrapped up in the next hour or so as we see the impact of severe weather all over the country. Overnight, torrential downpours in New York. We had teams out dropping sandbags around key areas, particularly in Queens. Drivers forced to navigate high water. A downed tree crushing a car in Queens, thankfully just the car. And sporadic flash flooding all day. This is Staten Island, the East Coast getting a taste of the wild weather already impacting the other side of the country. Heavy rain in San Francisco, which is also seeing widespread flooding. California snow in Sacramento, the state recovering from a record-breaking bomb cyclone now moving across the U.S. Bringing high wind to parts of the Midwest, churning up 16-foot waves on Lake Michigan, enough to sink a sailboat near Chicago. Steady rain still flooding streets across northern New Jersey, a state still recovering from the wrath of tropical storm Ida, which did heavy damage last month. If you're out on our roads and come across a flooded section, please just turn around. Don't go ahead. Sadly, we lost too many people in Ida uh, who went ahead. Flash flooding still a danger across the Northeast right now. We have flood watches in effect from Pennsylvania to southern New England and rain uh, giving us a break right now, Nicole, but expected to continue in a fairly significant way through tomorrow morning. All right, Tom, try to stay dry out there. Thank you.